Microsoft Windows Vista was released all the way back in 2001, and while Steady Mouse 2 works with it, uh, there's sometimes a compatibility issue that appears. So here I am uh, looking at the very end of the Steady Mouse installation, and since I have the launch Steady Mouse checkbox checked, it's going to try to run the program as soon as I finish. So let me do that now, and you're going to see an error. Here it is, a referral was returned from the server. First, rest assured, the installation did succeed. Uh, this is just a Windows Vista compatibility problem that I'll delve into in a moment. You get the same error if you try to double click the desktop icon. So there it is again. So anytime trying to launch the program, it fails to launch. Okay, what do we do about it? Go to the start menu, then go to control panel, and then from there go to user accounts and family safety and then uh, user accounts and then turn user account control on or off say continue and there will be a checkbox that you can change now newer versions of Windows all of this stuff just works but with Windows Vista this was the first version of the operating system that had this feature in it and Needless to say, uh, it took Microsoft a while to smooth out all of the kinks. So I'm going to turn this off, say OK, and then you're going to have to restart. And from there, uh, Steady Mouse will work great, and you won't have this problem anymore. So that's the situation with Windows Vista, but it's not too bad of a workaround. Otherwise, hope you enjoy.